Hello and welcome to a tutorial on how to install the FS9 panel. Now, for those of you who already know how to install a panel, please don't, please do not continue to watch this video for further information because you already know. And second of all, this will help newbies on how to install a panel while they're too lazy to read the emails. Please don't, so please bear with me here. I've already installed the panel. So I'm going to go to Mozilla Firefox. I'm going to go to the Avson library. You can go to flightsim.com uh, also to install a panel. Now, I'm going to install Boeing 737 panel for today's demonstration. So, here we go. And we'll, now, for since this is FS9, we'll put it there. We'll put it at the panel section. And you have these list of panels. I'm gonna go scroll I'm gonna scroll all the way down to the next page. This is the panel I will install today. Um the Boeing 737 700 800 900 series. File name is panel underscore 7378.zip. I've already installed this, so I'm gonna go I will not download it here. I will go to documents right here. Now the gauges and panels have been unzipped by myself here, so so here's what you do here. Uh, under the gauges, um, copy everything in here to the gauges folder. So I've already done that before the demonstration. So, but copy everything in the gauges folder to the FSI main gauges folder. Right here. This is where it is. Now to make it easier for you guys to see, I'll put details. So here's all the gauges you'll find. Under the panel folder, you have a panel folder with a couple bitmap files in the panel configuration. You will go here. You'll copy everything from here and put it to the, asso to the associated Boeing 737 uh, aircraft that you would like to install it under. For demonstration purposes, I'll put it. I'll install it under the Kitty Hawk Air Trans 737-700. It's a add-on aircraft available at Epson or FlightSim.com. Panel. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna delete everything in here since these are not needed right now. This, please bear with me here. It's gonna take a little longer. Again, please bear with me here while the, while everything begins to bleat. It's taking a little longer than usual because I have I deleted at the wrong time where everything is still trying to load. So what I'm gonna do is cancel it. See if this does anything. Yep, and I'll delete this time. Now, if you have user control uh, control on at Vista, you're gonna have to follow this. Don't, don't worry, continue, continue. There you go. Now what I'm gonna do is, oh, this one, this is not what's expecting. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do it again. Panel. Copy. Everything, at, then put at the associated Boeing 737 uh, aircraft of your choice. Right here. And there you have it. Everything is copied. Now, because my computer is a little slower here, we will uh, stop here, and that's the tutorial. Now, for some people, if you have effects also in your in the pan panel you're about to install, don't worry. Co co copy and paste everything, or ignore it. There's a couple things you might need you might need to know here, but I have nothing else. So that's how you pretty much install a panel and a gauge. And I'll hope to see you next time.